quite sure I hope it does with the statistics. It's not a good deal because yeah. there's a whole lot. Well, that's more the yeah the Levant thing, and then there's a whole lot more um, diseases transferred, like mad cow disease, and there's also called bovine leukemia virus, which is not the same, but but in the countries with the highest amount of milk drinking have the highest amount of leukemia among their uh, in the population. So that's what we're talking about. So there are a lot of problems with raw milk versus the, and, and pasteurized milk too. All milk. And yeah, like hyperactivity, schizophrenia, those are all and can be increased if you're allergic and certainly type 1 diabetes is somewhere uh, between 11 and 13 times more enhanced if you're having milk before three months from a cow. And that's a long story, but I won't go into it. So is that all dairy products? Just milk you're talking about? I'm talking about all dairy. <coughs> Ice cream is <laughs> about 25 times more concentrated. So milk's the least concentrated. So that's the milk thing. So, and then we have thou shalt not steal. We know the animals are staying alive, their fur, their flesh, you know, their destinies. Okay. That's a few few things. And thou shalt not covet, and really what goes on is you meat eating is a hoarding of resources. We're talking about the air, we're talking about the earth. Mm -hmm. uh, the animal agriculture accounts for thirty three percent of the arable land and most of the forest deforestation I mean goes on uh, the whole ecological thing is dramatic okay. so okay thou should not commit adultery that's called sexual perversion so how do you think you get the semen from the bull you get a transhuman animal interaction how do you think you inseminate cows. The farmer's sticking his hand up the vagina of a cow. Mm -hmm. Transhuman. That's what's called a sexual perversion. The chickens, how do you think they get inseminated? Okay, it's not with a rooster. So you get what I'm trying to say. So there are many levels of this where it breaks down. Inner peace, important. Clears the nadis and koshas, layers of the mind. So we become super connected with the divine. And again, diet and also social spirituality. Holistic life with veganism is not about moral superiority. I think it's, really it's about seeing the results of our actions. Mm -hmm. That's called wisdom. According to King Solomon, the wise person sees the results of their actions.